anti LGBTQ accounts. Like, why is it for attention? I'm just confused how someone can be so ill educated and not funny. Like, you know, we had Puff Tree. one of these sad, lonely people in a room who's making that account to make others, uh, you know, not laugh or, you know, try and use something that's very normal as an insult, then, you know, just feel very bad about yourself and you know, try and change the error of your ways and try and educate yourself a little bit. Thoughts on custard. Custard is great. I can't wrap, I just can't wrap my head around it, like, what do you think you're going to gain? It's, uh, it's very, very vile behaviour, you're right. Joe the roadie said, and I'm very rich. Hey, could I get a VM for Joe, please? Also, do you like my... Ocarina skin? Yes, I do, I do, that's you, you're a legend, you're very funny, I appreciate your work, and much love, Joe, thank you so much for uh, supporting the band. Shannon Billingham. Hey Andy, can I get a VM for Floppy Fowler? She needs cheering up badly. Of course she can. Hello Floppy Fowler. This is Andy. Much love from myself and Shannon. We both love you very, very much. And um, keep smiling. Thoughts on Harper's Feet? I haven't spent enough time with Harper's Feet to have an opinion of them, if I'm honest. You were on CBBC and Sunny got slimed. Oh, ah, that was today. Very interesting. Uh, yes, Sonny did get slimed. That was very funny. Um, I need to watch that. Potentially. Um, so we were... We were on Cracker Jack. Don't you think it's a bit late for a live? Is it? It's like not even nine o'clock here in the UK. I thought this was quite a chilled time. Um, cheer Wheeze up. Who Who is Wheeze? Who likes custard? I like custard. If we're talking about the type that goes on birthday cake, big fan. If we're talking about an innuendo thing, I don't know what you're talking about. Fifth year of being a roadie. Thank you so much, Kim. You are a ledge. I saw Harry Potter and the Cursed Child. Congratulations. I'm quite jealous. It's almost 5am here in Australia and I'm tired. You are more than welcome to go to bed, my dear. I've asked all the other boys, do you like gingers? Uh, I wouldn't not give someone my romantic or otherwise attention based on their hair colour. Uh, I shared it. Thank you very much, Isla. Like the little hair tie, put it around your head. Uh, nah, because the transplant is in a place where all the hair falls out for, so it can grow again. Like, you can see I'm starting to get a bit patchy there. Um, but yeah, it's growing through quite nicely. R red or green grapes. I'm a red man, personally. Can I have a VM for Abby and Nancy? What's going on, Abby and Nancy? Much love to the pair of you. Um... Apple or orange juice? Orange juice without the pips. Apple juice otherwise. Um, why didn't you shave your hair off? Because I didn't want to. Um, are you going to dance like Billy Elliot? Hopefully, because he was quite a sick dancer. So hopefully we can even remotely match him. I'm disappointed. I'm sorry to hear you are disappointed. All I can hear is right in the background. Uh, Alicia Hunt, Hunt Hutchinson 2. Thank you so much for all of the TikToks. I'm not sure what TikToks like equate to, what they used to be, if that makes sense. But I appreciate them. Thank you very much. Um, hello from, from Israel. Hello, Israel. What does your tattoo mean? It's a song lyric from my favourite song of all time holds a very poignant place in my heart that I'm not going to go through again. You are more than welcome to ask someone in this live stream who will know the answer. 122 TikToks from Alicia now. Thank you. Thank you. Much love. 
I've missed your lives. Thank you, Jen. That's very kind of you. I've missed doing them. Um, Suchbury says, hi, hello. I'm still say your second name wrong, and I'm an awful person. I'm very, very sorry. Um, guys, let's chat. What is everyone looking forward to most about Sunday, about Shepherd's Bush? Uh, what, what have people, you know, got in their mind that they are looking forward to? Because Road Trip are, are mad busy at the minute. We are, we really do not have a spare moment as Swedish roadie sends in and I'm very rich. Hi, could I have a VM to cheer me up, please? My day has been so bad. Sorry to hear that, Swedish roadie, but I uh, hope this little one-way chat does cheer you up. Much love from myself and the rest of the boys here in the UK, all the way to uh, to Sweden. We hope we can uh, come and see you guys out there uh, very, very soon. Uh, speaking of coming out there and, you know, doing shows, we're doing a tour of Poland as well, which is nuts. Like, we're finally kind of venturing out of the UK um, which, you know, we, we've needed to do for quite some time to see some of our international fans. Uh, as much as we love the UK and we love you guys who have uh, held the fort for the last five years or so, we do want to keep growing in the UK and we want to expand to around the world. And I don't think any UK fans will resent us for doing that and I don't think any international fans will have any complaints either. All good. Um, Alina Jane, thank you so much for the concert. Um... First live I've watched in a while, I've been too busy. Yeah, I mean, everyone has a, a right to be busy. Um, no, it's not obligatory that you watch these live streams, so just tune in when you can. It, all the support is appreciated, whether it's gifts, whether it's just a load of comments, whether it's sharing the live stream, everything does uh, help aid the band. Um, even if you're just sat there and have us on in the background, no matter who is on your screen, it is, it is a big help. Can you please do a cute VM for M from Rach? Well, hello, Rach. How are you doing? And to the rest of Train Trip, Gemma, Emma, and Rachel. Um, hello, Emma. This is Andy. Uh, I have a lot of love for you. Uh, I hope you're doing very, very well. And fingers crossed, look forward to seeing you at Shepherd's Bush. Um, good luck at Shepherd's Bush. Unfortunately, I won't be seeing you there. I'm sorry to hear that, but um, there are still a couple of tickets available. Um, we've seen a couple of things saying there's like... 2% of tickets left, which is mad. Like, we're that close to selling it out, which is insane. Uh, there are tickets on our stars website and Ticketmaster, I believe, so there might be a bit of confusion there. Uh, but we are trying to do everything we can to sell it out, just so that we can say that we sell out one of the uh, most prestigious venues in London as an unsigned band, um, which would be sick. So if you have anyone that is umming and ahhing about coming, Good as anything you've seen before and if you haven't been to a road trip show before i promise you that this first one will be worth the effort i promise you were you good at maths in school yes i was my phone is on five percent then make sure you charge it and then either watch whilst it's on charge or head back after you've got a bit more percentage how do you feel i feel fantastic i really do i feel very at peace with myself um I feel very chilled out, very relaxed as a person. Um, trying out this new social media thing where I don't glamorise the life of someone who's in the public eye, I suppose. And it's, uh, you know, it's having the desired, it's not the desired, it's having the effect that I thought it would where people are kind of tuning off, not liking as much, not commenting as much, um, unfollowing, which is absolutely fine. I, I'm kind of making the sacrifice on my own brand so the band doesn't have to. Um, to show that social media is glamorised and that people only care about someone when they're doing something that's exciting or they look good and that isn't the case for a lot of people in the public eye off camera and it's important to understand that there is a person behind that account um, who goes through everyday things just like the people who view that account every day and I think trying to break down that barrier uh, is, isn't going to appeal to everyone but to the ones who do understand it I think it's a very important message that we can all get across and we can um, stop some of the tragedies that have happened due to the actions of people on social media over the past few years to particularly reality stars and stuff like that. Being an ex-reality TV contestant myself um, and knowing the place that social media can put people in, um, I'm massively sympathetic and the, the news that's come out over the past year or so of different people who've decided to um, take drastic action as a result of social media, um, it hits, hits home quite a lot, so I want to try and make a difference in any way I can. Um, 
I can't come to see you because I live in America. I'm so sorry for that. Not, I'm not sorry you live in America. I'm very jealous of that, but I'm sorry that you can't be there. Um, but hopefully we have, we have enough surprises to make to be nice to international roadies as well at the same time. Andy, it's your 26th live. What do you mean? I've done live. Oh, it's your first live of being... Right, I understand. I apologise. Um, yeah, yeah, I've had a very, very chill day um, since every day, pretty much. Um, went to play football. Sustained a pretty gnarly knee injury. Those of you who've ever played an AstroTurf and know what it feels like to fall over on an AstroTurf is rough. Um, been trying to eat a bit cleaner as well. Like, I don't know if you can see, but bags and my... Legs and my eyes are kind of reduced a little bit. My skin's looking a bit clearer. I'm feeling like there's a bit less weight being held around my neck and stuff. So I'm very happy about that. I'm very happy that I'm making that change. And I'm not doing anything drastic. I'm not going to look like, realistically, like Sonny. Because um, he's naturally blessed, bless him, um, by Shepherd's Bush. But I just want to kind of be in a place where I'm looking after my body more. Um, not necessarily so that I'm more confident in it, just as like a little, as a health kick, I guess, because I'm not the healthiest person when it comes to eating and lacking diet. I always look for an excuse um, to get out of exercising properly. Uh, I'm very much a bruiser. I'm very much like the, the guy that's in a load of pain the day after. So things like that are good. They, they help aid my mental state as well. I'm in a very relaxed place. I really am. It's the... Uh, it's the least time in my life where I've felt the need to make everything a joke to deal with it, if that makes sense. Like, I've um, often resorted to sarcasm and snide remarks to deal with something if I'm not very comfortable with it, or to be the centre of attention. I don't feel like I have to do that 24-7 anymore. I just feel very relaxed. Weirdly, I feel very normal, and that sounds pretentious to say, but in the sense that um, for the best part of a decade I've been a personality on social media and now I'm kind of not letting that phase me anymore um, and just making the focus of everything um, music and my love of my job more so than trying to please everyone because that is impossible could you bear with me two seconds right I'm, right, I'm, li I'm just live in my bed do you mind grabbing me a water? Yeah, thanks man. Thank you very much. Do you know, oh, we're not getting any mugs. I'll grab it after. It's fine. Wait, you want a water? No. Do you want some shade? No, thank you. Let's go. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. Oh. Okay, okay. <laughs> no, no, no. We've had about... What? What? Randy at its finest. Yeah, why not? Um, we need a Randy live soon. Awesome. Yeah, we can, um, I'm sure we can make that happen. If you have anything you request seeing on live streams, then please do let us know. Um, like, if it's certain pairings, if it's a theme thing, whatever you want to do. Because, if we're honest, um, we do these live streams for you. We, we do this to try and be a constant source of entertainment. We have loads of different so, uh, social medias and platforms that we try and put content on regularly, but these live streams are a live interaction with you guys because we can't come and see you guys every day. So if there's anything you want from these live streams, please do let us know. Whiskey is not going to happen. Um, I, I, I take my JD with Coke and we don't have Coke and also is irresponsible to drink in front of a young audience. Whole band live. Uh, they are doable, but they are very, very impractical because it's five people constantly talking over each other. We've got different levels of eyesight and stuff like that. And the screen is very small to fit everyone on. But uh, maybe for a special occasion, it could be something we do. Um, sunny AF, yes, potentially. Come sometime to Italy. Yes, I'd love to do that. Uh, Andy and Harper. Why not? Why not? We can, we can make that happen. I will... Uh, Speak to Harper about potentially organising one. But please bear in mind that it is nine days before the show. Um, and our sole focus is on making that show amazing. So, you know, please keep these suggestions in mind. And then pester us with them um, once the show is over. Fobs React, yeah. That's a little throwback. Cat Minus 2, I believe it was called. Um, I've spent all my coins. I'm, I'm very sorry to hear that. Please don't overspend. Um... It's the same principle as, as, as gambling, in that, um, oh, I don't go into this. 
you essentially spend real money to get gift points in the hope that the person you're sending them to gives you preferential treatment. And as much as we do try 99.9% of the time to, to reward those people with preferential treatment, we do miss them. So there is an element of gambling. So as the slogan says online, when the fun stops, stop. Um, and please ask the bill payers permission, etc., etc. Um, I'll gamble for you, Jen. You are a smooth criminal. Bring overload back. That is not going to happen. P.S. You got two in here anyway. Um, Hannah Louise misses you. Miss you too, Hannah Louise. I've been a fan of you one year tomorrow. Fantastic. Thank you so much. Thank you to everyone who's uh to stuck by the band. I know last year was a bit of a term turmoil year, but this year started off with a bang. Um. It's been it's been good. We've got a few things out of the way we've needed to do, and we've uh, we've also started preparing for things that we've we've needed to do for for some time. Someone uh, someone just said, do a twelve hour live stream again, and unless there is a cause, past streaming figures, which I think you guys are capable of replicating without um, incentive, I like a, a natural disaster or an event that needs awareness raising for it, I will personally not be doing one again. Yo, 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 it is Harper. How bizarre is that? Well, you didn't know. Well, literally, I was just asking them what they wanted from live streams. Yeah. And uh, one of the top requested things was myself and yourself in a live stream together. Well. Wow. How bizarre is that? that if we sell out Shepherd's Bush in the next 24 hours, we'll oh, do a 24 man. hour live stream. <laughs> there you go. I said it here first. That doesn't mean one of you go out and buy them all and put your parents or yourself in a load of debt. Let's do it legit. We want that place filled out. So, 24 hour live stream. Yeah, but bear in mind that I will sleep for 12 hours of it mm. and have an, uh, an actual representation of what I do in the day anyway. But yeah, screen record that, put that everywhere. If you want a 24 hour live stream, sell out Shepherd's Bush in the next 24 hours. And I will be there. But, um, but there you go. Get your guitar out, not a chance. Um, I good, but I'm going through surgery. I'm sorry to hear that. Please, uh, please recover soon. Becky J Vidral 09 says, "Can I get a VM for my friend Flaming Roadies? She's not feeling well. I'll follow you, Becky. You should be followed." Uh, hello, Flaming Roadies. You're hello, with Flamin myself Roadie. and Harper. Um, heard you're not feeling great. I hope you recover well. I hope you get well soon, and um, have a speedy and safe and lovely recovery. Um, can you come to Canada? We've been once. Uh, I believe we had a stopover in Toronto. And uh, everyone there was very nice. It fit the stereotype. Lovely. Laura the Cuddly Roadie. I just want to say I'm very proud of you guys and hope to meet you one day. Laura, I, uh, I love the sentiment and I completely agree. We'd love to meet you as well. I'm from Belgium. Love Belgium. Uh, Alice misses you. Miss you too, Alice. Opinion on Harper's feet. Well, he does oh, have a thank you, now. mate. Tell me my feet. They're all right, aren't they? They're not bad at all. What, what's thank what's you. the joke? What's the meme? Brooke was saying I got bad feet yesterday, but I think it's just he's against feet in general. I don't think but they're bad as feet. far as feet go... I think they're all right. All right, aren't they? There's nothing wrong with them. Thanks. You've got much better little toenails than I do. I've got the one of those little toenails. That oh, like there is toenail. a really toenail. Yeah. <laughs> So yeah, Thanks, you've bro. smashed that. Thanks, bro. Uh, will I get, when will I get a notice on Instagram? Um, I am shocking at Instagram. Um, you're probably better uh, redirecting your attention to ro at Road Trip TV and hoping for the best that way. <laughs> Ignore that. <laughs> Girl Trip TV sent and I'm very rich. VM for Kate, she can't make mess, uh, Shepherd's Bush because she dislocated her hip. Ah, oh, Kate, I've been there. Been there. It's it's a rough little pain that is. Um, hit. Slipped a disc in my hip when I was in high school. Yeah. Oh. Sitting down. No joke. It was bizarre. Just getting to, like you just go and sit down. And yeah, it was on one of those chairs in the science lab, like the physics ones that oh, were like, yeah. slightly higher, and I just sat on it and just went. <laughs> I was like, oh, and the teacher was like, oh, you got appendicitis. I was like, no, I don't love. <laughs> and I kicked the ball the next day, and I felt my leg just came out of the socket. It was bizarre. But anyway, yeah, Kate. Um, so sorry to hear that. Um, speedy recovery do not put too much pressure on that hip and then get yourself in physio in six months um uh, have you listened to justin's new album no i haven't rye has and he, he gave me a reference that wasn't particularly positive i'm a huge fan of uh of justin's newer stuff so i will get give it a listen at some point but uh, my main focus at the minute is just getting everything ready for Shepherd's Bush, more so than listening to other music. Look, we're nine days away. I know. Nine. Nine days. That's less than ten. 
And more than eight, but not by much. That's more than three days. I know, it is it's a bit mental. nutty. It's a bit nutty, Professor. I'm going to finish tidying my room. Oh, he's nice. tidying the room. I did that yesterday. It was good, didn't it? It's a nice. It's, it's nice. A, it's a nice. 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 Um, I live in the freaking USA and I'm broke. I'm sorry to hear that, but at least you live in the USA. Any tips on learning French? Um, Audiobooks. What's his name? Michelle Thomas. He does a really good set. Um, but yeah. And uh, just have a load of conversations. See you in Poland. See you in Poland. People still send it in TikToks. Thank you so much. Where's your water? Um, there weren't any clean glasses, so I've said that I will get one after. I've missed your live stream, Fobs. Yeah, I do you know what? It's one of those things that when I'm not doing them, I'm like, oh, the thought of going live is a bit of a mission. Um, but then when I'm here, I'm like, it's just chill. It's just nice to chat. I, th I do think the 12-hour live stream has put me off them slightly. Um, I'm coming to... Coming from Egypt to Poland. Madness. Look forward to seeing you. Thank you so much. Mikey's live too. It's a struggle. Well, you know, do what you got to do. If you want to go and watch Mikey, you are more than welcome. I have no qualms with Mikey whatsoever. Um, Kells, I love road trip, underscore Jack, underscore Lolly. Could I get a VM, please? Kenzie's stressed by school, but you always make her smile. What's going on, Kenzie? How you doing? This is Andy. Uh, I hear you're a bit stressed by school. I just want to say that... Uh, just enjoy it as much as you can. Things like exams and revision and homework is very stressful. But uh, when you're out of it, you'll realise it's not all that bad. Um, just keep a positive mental attitude and don't leave anything to the last minute. Would be my piece of advice. Um, Randy singing live. Oh, no. What are the others doing? I actually have no idea. People, um, people who are just, you know, trying to get hate comments off the live stream, I appreciate the effort you're putting in, but it's almost giving the, the attention they want, like, I'm not sure if you can click on names and block anymore, and I'd love to do that without raising attention to their account once more, because I try and preach positivity, um, but I don't believe you can, so I would just ignore it. What have you got there? Just some fake down, man. Are you doing, doing another time? No, no, I did one last night. I went a bit over the top. Yeah. This you... is for Brooke. Just to remind him that it's there. Very nice. Got that. Very nice. I got a level nine in my music. Congratulations. Did you go to college? I did, yes. I got five A levels. Right, here we go. Here we go. Can you just block that name? Manage block. Oh, there you go. Have they been blocked? I think they're blocked. I'm not sure. Fingers crossed. Are you smart? Um, I think I used to be quite book smart. Have you ever faked hand? Yeah, or about six days ago. Bear with me two seconds. Cute song. Do you like it? Yeah. I made it up just now. It's cute. It's sick, mate. It's cute. Keep, keep singing it. Hey, I'll play that in mine. Yep. <laughs> that in mine. Yeah, there you go. Strawberry or chocolate milkshake? Chocolate. All day, every day. What 5A levels did you get? French, maths, psychology, ICT and music. Ah, oh, brilliant. I thought you got blocked, no? Why is it not letting me block you? Just, you know, you've got your attention. Just, you know, get alive. 
Five, I did three. Yeah. Um, there's nothing wrong with any level of education. I'm watching your vlogs right now. Awesome. My brother keeps waving at you. Well, there's a wave right back. I just chose my GCSEs and I'm so stressed out. Um, I think you'll have fun regardless. Why are you all fake tanning? Uh, we had a special shoot that you'll find all about on Sunday. Silver or blonde? Um, white. Is there going to be a new EP? Well, aren't these very fantastic questions? What's your lucky number? 16, because it's mine and my mum's birthday date. Um, 7, for footballing reasons. And 1. Uh, 1's kind of the number I stand by, if that makes sense. I dare you to drop a what? To drop an album? No, we are not there yet. Right-handed or left-handed? I am right-handed. Robert Lewandowski, any thoughts? Good striker, but you know. It's my birthday, happy birthday, I hope you have a fantastic day. Are you sleeping well? I'm sleeping, you know, as well as ever. Just don't go on Twitter as much to brag about it. UK tour soon. Uh, highly unlikely, but never say never. Dare You Not To, that is the name of another band, Kim. Uh, you know, I'm sure they're very, very nice lads. No qualms against them either, much love. You look sick, you're taking care of yourself. Yeah, I'm fine. Might just be a, might just be a, uh, a filter. There you go, nice and pink and lovely. And there you go, pale. It's not eating a lot. This one, all good. Have you heard Billy's new song? I have. You came to my school. Awesome. Thank you for uh, for carrying on supporting us um, after the assembly. What's the best social media? Um, all of them, equally. the boys doing just chilling in the kitchen I believe making some food Someone just said you can't not reveal new music. That is actually a song called Nervous by Gavin James. No. Shut up, that's your new song. Ah. 
Give us the name of the least first letter, Emma. <laughs> Update false mix. I've got a couple of songs on there recently. Um, I can jump out a bit more. After March the 1st. Ticket links in all of our buyers. Go and grab your tickets. Um, yeah, I'm going to jump off. It's been fun. I will make sure I do this again sometime. Thank you all for tuning in and watching. Shepherd's Bush, March the 1st. Make sure you get yourself there if you can. If not, it's okay. Thank you for supporting the band regardless. But if you can, make sure you do it. Bring a friend. Bring 20 friends. But yeah, it's going to be sick. It's going to be the best road trip show ever. I'm genuinely buzzing. It's very rare you see me buzzing. Very rare you see me happy. It's normally when we get a number. It's normally something to do with music. Normally when an EP comes out or we chart well. All big shows. And this is the big.